Hi, I'm Nam. Now I will show you the communication between Raspberry Pi and Arch. You know, you know, using serial port communication. The hardware materials we need to have are first Raspberry Pi, the USB A to USB B cable for connecting to device, the Arch. You know, you know. Read the analog signal from this sensor, ACS712 current sensor. Current sensor will measure the required current for the water pump, the potentiometer for controlling the power rating, 12 voltage power supply for the water pump now you see the result on the raspberry pi and not red the button when i turn on the power you see the current is changed more power The current is higher. Next, we go to the wire for connections. Here, the wire connections. We use the ACS712 for measuring the required current from the load. And the USB cable for connecting to device. Arduino, you know, and Raspberry Pi. Next, we go to the Arduino programming. Here, this is the proxy for the Arduino you know. First, you need to define the serial port, port rate 9600. Declare some parameters. This function to read the analog signal from the current sensor my analog being zero it depends on your wire connections this function to calculate the required current from the current sensor you need to read the data sheet for more information it depends on your sensor specification and put the data into the string now you compiling for any errors choose choose the ball choose the port zero port and now upload the data into the device Turn on the serial port monitor. It's okay. Next, we go to the Raspberry Pi for configurations and make not red flows. On the Raspberry Pi, first you need to enable the serial port by click here. Go to Raspberry Pi configurations. Open it. Interfaces Turn on it Serial port And you need to turn off Serial control Click OK After that you need to restart your Raspberry Pi For new configurations Now you start your not red This is my not red workplace. First, you need to click here. Go to manage palette and install serial port not. Click here. Serial port. Click to install it. I have installed before.
Now you see the serial port knob. Choose this to read the data from changer via serial port communication. Choose the debug function. Connect them. Open it to configure. Click Edit. And here you need to check your USB port by turn on the terminal. Enter. This USB serial port. Copy. Return to not read. Paste it here. Choose the right Blu-ray with the same value on Arduino programming. Update. Done. Deploy. Now you see the value current here. Okay, that's all of my video. If you have any question about this, you can contact me by put the comment below. Thank you.